is up YouTube, what's cool to bring us hand it's time for life. So I just want to sit here and talk to you guys about like how are you experiencing this whole lockdown thing that is happening sporadically all over the world? How are you dealing with keeping your distance from people? Because I'm really the more I think about it, I'm just like the way we are living right now is not normal. Okay. I used to compare this life that we're having right now to war, war times or being in a war-torn country right where you can't see other people or uh, you know things are a bit difficult or food is scarce as it was at the beginning of all this stuff when people were going out and buying all the food and all the luro and stuff like that right food is scarce things are scarce you can't see your family you can't see your friends you can't just go out and dance you can't just go out and party you can't just go out and do all these things because there's a war going on and now we're fighting a war against this invisible virus obviously but it's different and it's different because everything is still or could still be open and some things are open and people are free to to walk about and do what they want to do right in some countries there are curfews and stuff like that so no you're not free but yeah in some countries they've come up with this interesting screen where you can um where you can <laughs> where you can see whether people are close or not so like in a busy street it'll just show you like there's a camera filming you but there will be a, a, a green or red red circle just covering your entire face so that obviously your privacy in that and if it's red that means you're too close to people and if it's green that means you're good and um yeah there is even um there's even this thing in japan where they would walk and it's like a circle and in your circle on the ground it's like projecting fish and if you come too close to somebody else, your fish will escape. So your whole goal as you're walking is to make sure that you, your fish stay in your circle. You guys, you can't you can't even make this stuff up, but there's so many things being invented and so much stuff out there. And it's because people are trying to make the keeping the distance fun because they know that this is very unnatural and they know that this is very, very hard for people. So anyway, I just wanted to come on here, let you guys know that these are things that people are doing. There was even a, a news reporter who had like a hula hoop that went round in a circle of one and a half meter to see what that distance is like. And that's when you know that it is actually impossible once you're out there to really keep your distance. Like I had to go to the shop the other day and over there they were just, they were just, wow, that place was crazy. Too many people, just too many people. And sometimes I have limited baskets or something like that so that, you know, once it's, it's they're gone it's gone and you cannot go and uh you cannot go in the store there's no basket you you can't go into the store without a basket so you have to wait till somebody else comes out with a basket but oh my goodness the store was full we were just walking as if we were walking down the aisle tan 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 step one tan 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 step two it was crazy it was too much it was too much but we do not know how to keep our distance but the mass the mass should help you guys Mass help if you work or have worked in the medical field you will know that masks work because you can be taking care of people that have respiratory things going on that have illnesses and when you wear that mask it does protect so you guys it's not something that people are just taking out of thin air this has worked for centuries this has worked for a very 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 long time wear your mask and yeah try and keep your distance the best thing is to stay home Find a new hobby, find something to do to keep yourself busy at home because it's not that bad. Get yourself busy, then you won't be bored. Busy, something that's productive, maybe start making videos, make up, start up a podcast, something that's not like you just taking from like, like Netflix and you just taking from like you not getting anything back from what you're doing, just kind of wasting time. Do something that's productive in the sense of it actually offering up a project like it actually op offering up or what do you call it the result of it being a project or something that you can visibly see or know that you gain from it whether that's you learning something you know that you've always wanted to learn that could be a language something that has an end result that is tangible visible and yeah that will make you feel good about yourself but would that will also educate you that will make you better for it find something like that Home does not have to be boring because when you're out there, keeping your distance is hard and all these tricks they're coming up with, ain't nobody want to do all that. Just stay home because most of you don't want to be told what to do anyway. 
so you would not be happy with a camera shining on you being like oh you're in the red no some of y'all stubborn very stubborn very very stubborn so yeah keep your distance for real for real and stay home as much as possible there's nothing out there for you but to go around and spend useless money or catch coro so yeah that's uh my two cents if you're not already part of the family make sure you hit um stomp as well to the subscribe button comment because i really want to know what you think like because you obviously like this video and hit the notification bell while you it i'll see you in the next video which will be tomorrow god bless make time for Bye.